Hey everyone, and welcome to my channel. Today, I'm going to be taking you to Makoko, a floating slum in Lagos, Nigeria. Makoko is one of the largest slums in Africa, and it's home to over 100,000 people. The community is built on stilts over the Lagos Lagoon, and it's a fascinating and unique place. Makoko is a waterfront slum in Lagos, Nigeria. It is home to an estimated 250,000 people and is considered to be one of the largest slums in Africa. The community is built on stilts above the Lagos Lagoon and is made up of a maze of narrow alleyways and wooden shacks. Makoko was originally a fishing village and many of the residents still make their living from the sea. However, the community has also become a center for trade and commerce and is home to a number of small businesses. Despite its vibrant community, Makoko is also a place of poverty and deprivation. The residents of Makoko lack access to basic amenities such as running water, sanitation, and electricity. The community is also prone to flooding and is at risk from the effects of climate change. In recent years, there have been a number of efforts to improve the lives of the people of Makoko. The Lagos state government has pledged to provide the community with basic amenities, and there have been a number of non-governmental organizations working to improve education and health care in the area. However, much work remains to be done, and Makoko remains a challenging place to live. Makoko has been inhabited for centuries, and it's believed to be the oldest fishing community in Lagos. The community is home to a diverse range of people, including fishermen, carpenters, and traders. Makoko is also a major center for the production of smoked fish, which is a popular delicacy in Nigeria. Life in Makoko can be difficult. The community is overcrowded, and the homes are often made of flimsy materials. There is also a lack of access to basic amenities, such as clean water and sanitation. However, the people of Makoko are resilient, and they have created a vibrant and thriving community. Makoko is becoming increasingly popular with tourists, who are drawn to its unique culture and way of life. There are a number of tours available, which offer visitors the chance to explore the community and learn about its history and culture. Here are some of the challenges faced by the people of Makoko. Poverty. The majority of the people of Makoko live in poverty. The average income per capita is estimated to be $1 per day. Lack of access to basic amenities. The people of Makoko lack access to basic amenities, such as running water, sanitation, and electricity. This has a negative impact on their health and well-being. Flooding. Makoko is prone to flooding. This is a major problem, as it destroys homes and businesses, and makes it difficult for people to get around. Climate change. Makoko is at risk from the effects of climate change. The rising sea levels are a major threat to the community, as they could eventually submerge the entire settlement. Despite these challenges, the people of Makoko are resilient and resourceful. They have created a thriving community in a difficult environment and are determined to improve their lives. Makoko is a fascinating and unique place to visit. It's a community with a rich history and culture, and it's a place where people from all walks of life come together to create a vibrant and thriving community. If you're ever in Lagos, I highly recommend visiting Makoko. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video about Makoko, a floating slum in Lagos, Nigeria. If you have any questions, please leave a comment below. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more videos like this one.